Everybody for now. <laughs> Whole family group chat for now. It's gonna be blown up. What is up, YouTube? It's your boy Takes. Just coming back again with another video. And today, as you see by the title, we'll be reacting to Entitled Manager still over $14,000 from Dollar General. 14 bands. That's a lot. Don't know what. He or she was thinking. If you're a returning person, I appreciate it. Love you. Thank you for returning back. We locked in forever. Uh, to my new people, hope I can win you over, entertain you. If I if, if you stay and you enjoyed it, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Appreciate it. Let's get right into it. Hope you're having a wonderful day as well. Don't put your hand cuffs, what? Think well, I don't care. <laughs> Maybe two years, please, I don't On <laughs> August 16th, 2023, in Florida, officers Solid received floor. a call from a local Dollar General. The reason for the call was that the business was short almost $14,000. After conducting an audit, it appeared that a manager who was in charge of the cash deposits had been stealing thousands of dollars from the safe she was responsible for. And that's what I need to get very clear because, because I'm not going to trample over her civil rights because somebody else did. It was, so, it was all just to pay my mom my brother's funeral. He just died. I understand. <laughs> he just told me that if I were that, I would go to jail. Understand that regardless of what statements are made, right, that is for you to dispute with a lawyer. As far as we are concerned, you have now committed the act of grand theft. That is a felony. We have no choice. We must make an arrest and we must take you in. They are the entity representing the business and they are requesting that we take law, law enforcement action against you. That is our position on it, okay? Regardless of whether we think that their investigation went right or wrong, as far as we are concerned, we are w -Cop. Our He's explaining in the proper well. order, okay? What's your Miranda? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Wow. The only reason I wrote that because he told me I wouldn't go to jail if I wrote that. He was right here with me sitting saying that. So, <laughs> we're you. not going to take that or use it. I know, I know. So, that's, I mean, that's just going to be something that they'll... <laughs> that's on my that, record. That'll yeah. be yeah. for their yeah. records. And okay, well, that's what they're going to do. As far as we are concerned, <laughs> right. we will give you the opportunity right. if you would like to, to make a statement. And we will document it properly. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, just a moment here while we sort things out. Oh, close the door, so Yeah. The suspect told officers when they arrived that she was promised if she provided a full statement, they would not pursue charges. Mm -hmm. She then admitted to stealing the money for a family it. member's She's funeral. <laughs> you're not going to steal. You're not going to steal fourteen thousand dollars and not get away with it. Please don't tell me she thought that. There's no way she thought that. You're not going to steal fourteen thousand dollars and get away with it at all. There's no way. Regardless of what anybody yes. tells you, that's Can just you plain stupid. I'm sorry. Can you take me out the back door again? Don't put me in handcuffs, please. Um. <laughs> Think what? I don't care. <laughs> I've been here two years. Please, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, just relax for a second. We're not quite there yet. Yeah, and are you her supervisor normally? Okay, so she's made the statement to us that she was um, told that if she provided a, a statement um, that she would, that you guys would not pursue prosecution as long as you did make that statement to her. Okay, okay. I'll just yeah, need to clarify. Because, uh, I'm here because I, I was trying to say for you. Yeah, know what I mean? yeah, I'm there. The lady's inspiration. Yeah. Am I gonna turn it down? She's gonna do her thing. Yeah. I was trying to at least if she was willing to cooperate. Yes. I was assuming that law prevention was going to yeah. uh, take take that into consideration and accept mm -hmm. you know, like a deal. You yeah, know? yeah, yeah. But it looked like she Yeah, unfortunately. Okay. Those those kind of deals. So because of that, um, do you have ID so we can just document that we spoke with you and that, that statement she's she's alleging that, that statement was made mm -hmm. and um so, as far as we are concerned, um, we can't accept any of this because it was all done under duress and, all, and under a false pretense. She was coerced, essentially. You, you've made false 
uh, pretenses that she wouldn't go to jail. And we have nothing to do with that. Yeah, but yeah. as far as her, we just need to document that this is the allegation that she's making and mm -hmm. that we properly read her Miranda and we let her know that anything that she states to us at the, after mm -hmm. this point, you know, can and will be used against her. So I just need your ID and that was all. No, I don't know where to find my ID. I don't have to. I haven't committed any crime. You're part of the investigation as the authorized representative and as her supervisor who brought her in here. You are now part of the investigation. You're going to raise your tone. I'm not raising my tone at all, sir. I've only spoken with you. He's hiding something. I want. I feel like he's hiding something. I'm going to provide my ID because I haven't kind of the law. No problem. I'm happy that this is happening. Okay. I didn't want to have Bro, just give me your ID. No is 254. I am Man, sure the testosterone the levels are okay. high. Yeah. Okay. Also, okay. he has a protection order issued against him. Uh -huh. Is there a voice in the camera? Huh? Is there a voice in the camera? No. It was all him when he said to me right under the camera right here. I'm sure he's telling the truth. So, like this officer said, regardless of what took place, the crime took know, place so we can't get around that I know. so you know a lot of times you know people can choose not to prosecute at first and then change their mind you, That's, tell me if I... you know what i mean my glasses are not working today huh. i can't really see you carriage one working 11 you're 213. I'm just stuck on the fact 14,000? What do you write? What what do you write, man? I think you can get away with 14,000, though. Like, let alone $1,400. $1,400 is a lot anyway, but 14,000? That's a down payment. <laughs> that's a down payment for a house, car, whatever. That's a down payment. You just stole a down payment. Literally. I think that's a felony. Whatever, but um, I can detail the deposits. I'm I just don't understand why they would tell her she wouldn't go to jail. She broke down. Yeah, so he just lied. Yeah, Basically, and just you know, like I don't let that do nothing. He just lied. And he don't want to his ID. Okay. He's suspicious. Yeah, well, doesn't you know. See what's that about? And your brother was um, yeah, in March, right? Yeah, my mom. Yeah. My dad, mom died of cancer. My brother died of heart attack. The 2600 one is, is, is on the slip, all of them. It was only the 15, the 2010, and the 22. As of this morning, the 2600 is still not in the bank. And that was from. Yeah, no, the that, that one, yeah, that one that was. was the yellow slip is, should be with the ones that were here yesterday. He's only blessed. The 15, the 22, and the 22. And she bawled her eyes out, didn't she? Her eyes are bawling. She's going to get the 26 is the one that I um, faxed over. Yeah, yeah. The 26 boys is the Come on, man. Go ahead and slot that paper down. We're trying to see, too. The too. No, they're there. This is the one that you had. The one you had. I didn't put that one on that. Do you have right. uh, the photo ID also? It's outside. Okay. Um. So, were you gonna email me this or? Yeah. Um. How did you want me to? No, you can just email me the whole spreadsheet. I'll just. Yeah. You just put on email. I'll put my email address. Once we get you searched, I can allow you to. Yeah, she can come down. Yeah. yeah. Get the... So, um... Ms. Howie. Yes. Um, I need you a couple of. I need you to uh, initial the statement here. Then on this line, you're going to print your name because you want to prosecute on behalf of the business and then sign. Okay. okay. And this statement basically says that you swore and affirm that your statement is true and correct. So who knowledge. is she? She has a protection or what? Can I take my um, debit card out and give it to, for my daughter? Just give it to your girl or to my daughter? 
about it. Um, Save the puppies. Can I do the girl? Yeah, the black one. The girl that's working on the. Yeah, the black one. The tall one. Yeah. Yeah, take whatever you want to give to her out. Is that not evidence? That's all I'm saying. I thought that would be evidence. Yeah. So the whole family worked at me. I only acknowledge the 1500 and the other 22 and 22. That's it. It's not, it's not this other one. It's just the last one. And the two yeah. Tw and the two 22s. So, yeah, the, the, well, like this one and the two 22s? Yeah, it's the 22 and the 22. One, two, three? Yeah. The other ones are, no, I dropped them off there. Okay. Well, the, the amounts that the charges go is anything over five thousand, between five and twenty thousand. So whether it's six thousand or ten thousand, it'll be like the same bond. I haven't done a second degree misdemeanor in a while. First one is like I'll stay between five, six thousand. Yeah, you're not one hundred percent sure. Like five thousand dollars cast in? Yeah, like if oh. you do like uh, ten percent. Right, right. Uh, Can I call my dog, please? Because nobody knows. Why are bonds like? Gonna be to skip, yeah. For example, their bond is like nine thousand dollars. Why do they only have to pay ten percent? <laughs> What's the point of having a nine thousand dollar bond here? If they only gonna pay like nine hundred, I've always wanted to. Like I don't, I don't understand it. Like, hello, hey Tori, <laughs> can you hear me? Are you okay? No, I'm. What you? Don't worry. Don't tell nobody. But I gave Jen my debit card at work. So you can show her, call her on Facebook. They're, what? They're taking me to jail. So if you could bail me up. Why are they taking you to jail? Because of deposits. But, um, I mean, I didn't go yet, so I don't know how long it's going to be, but oh, sure, what does she have to do? Hey, Kyrie. What are you talking about? At work. I'll tell you later, but what does she have to do? The police officer's right here. You're in speakerphone. Um, hey, Kyrie. When, when they're ready to... Sorry, my grandson. <laughs> When they're ready to right, Buffy, hey, Kyrie. bond you out, they will oh, allow you to make a phone Jen. call. Jen, it works. Okay. They said when they're when you come bomb me out later on today, I don't know how it's gonna be. I guess you just have to look online. Are you doing money, bro? Okay, we're back to Sorry. Kyrie, it's okay, I'm right here. Hey, Kai Kai. Okay. Hey. Hey, so how does she look Wait. now? No, you, you, got you or someone will call her when you're ready to go. and. Uh, right. I'll call you when I'm ready to go. It could be a couple hours. I'll explain to you later. Is this, this lady like not detained, though? So, Tori, for my one card that Jen has, the Amps got one, and I heard the other one, you have to go to Wells Fargo, and you can only take out three, um, $300 at a time. So you have to do three transactions for $300. So, I don't know if I can take off today. I'm going to get in trouble with work. Yeah, don't tell nobody else. <laughs> you know, somebody's out of a job. I'll tell you that. All right, I'll go. <laughs> don't mean to have humor here, but <laughs> somebody's no, out of a job. All right, I'll call you, um, what, you think, a couple hours? Uh, could Maybe be slightly hours. more than that. More it's than not, that. That's up to, I don't know what the process is. But they have you in front of the store, like, they, they won't put you in the office or anything? They're waiting for the lady to come. I asked him to take me out the side door, but I don't know. He said he's not going to put me in handcuffs. 
But Jennifer, Tori, you're friends with Jen on Facebook, right? So you can call her. Jen, Jennifer. Gonna, how long is she going to be there for? She works till 2.30. Please don't tell Alan or nobody else yet. Oh, Alan's going to find out. <laughs> Alan's going to find out one way or another. Yeah, you should have told me. All right. I would have helped you. Yeah. You could have came and lived with me. I already told you that stuff. I know. All right. Okay, get mad all you want. Like, this is, this is an example. It's going to be on your freaking record. You know how hard it is? You want to let the family make up the plan? And Miguel, Miguel said he told me that he wasn't there. He goes, you know, he's going to get arrested. Bravo, Yankee. I feel a little off. Thank you. Why are you yelling? All right, I'm going to go because he's letting me use the phone and not supposed to. Yeah. Uh, don't tell nobody, please. Everybody for no. <laughs> Whole family group chat for no. It's gonna be yeah, blown up. Uh, yeah, that's what that counts. Thank you. And I don't know if our city got a busted, but. If you do, just send her to the office. We'll it's public record. Yeah. Uh, thanks. Uh, Alright, I'm gonna go to get here. Hey, everybody. It was, uh, walk out, going to the there real quick. And, uh, Car is right out here, but I'm parked like facing that way, so I'll be facing away from the store. Thank you. I don't know. There's a deputy coming in. If you call, call. Make sure she... They might not be familiar with the store like we are. I'm sorry. She says it's Yeah. They, uh. Standard Prairie Call, zone 12, so 42 dollar general, 1113, West First Street, 1113, West First Street, I need to call around, though. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, I need a female partner to search. Okay, makes sense. Yeah, let's do it in here. Okay. Yeah, let's do it in here. Okay. Hold on. Did you call us up? Yeah, you did. Please do open. I don't have to get dressed, do I? No. Oh, okay. Just put your stand up. Thank you. Okay. Stand back. Three, two, black male subject. I'm one last thing. Mark all our clothing on foot. And one last thing. Mark all black clothing. This is um, the thing of my bra. Pull your backpack. Uh, can't tell the bicycle. <laughs> Why is she smiling though? Why is she smiling? Yo, man, this lady really needs some help. The suspect was charged with felony grand theft and received five years of probation. Do you think she received a fair sentence? Share your thoughts below and don't forget to subscribe. Five years? Yeah. Five years? Oh, wow. It's a lot. But, uh, anyway, let me know what you think. Let me know what you think down below. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you... <laughs> Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, 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 subscribe. Let me know what you thought about the video, please. Honestly, I, I appreciate all comments. Uh, if you enjoyed this video, do what I said. Like, comment, subscribe. <laughs> long day, long day. Um, honestly, have a great day. Make sure you watch another video, two videos of mine. Leave a thumbs up. I appreciate it. Take Christmas out. Peace.